Okay, welcome to this uh, product comparison video. What we've got here for you today is three packs of fertility uh, lubricants or conception, preconception lubricants. Uh, they are all sperm friendly. They're all personal lubricants intended for use at times of conception and during times when couples are trying to get pregnant and conceive. Now, the first onto the market was Pre-Seed. Uh, for a number of years now been uh, sub-branded as Baby Star. Most of you will be familiar with these packs. And the middle is the, the latest onto the marketplace, which is the Astroglide Trying to Conceive, water-based, sperm-friendly personal lubricant. And here on the uh, very left we have uh, the Sasmar Conceive Plus uh, Fertility Lubricant in an 8 pre-filled applicator pack. So we're just going to run you slightly through uh, the three packs, what you get and the rough guide in terms of the cost that these are currently retailing for in the UK market. So if we start with the SASMAR on the, uh, the, the left, in this pack you get eight pre-filled applicators. Each of the applicators contains four grams, which in our estimate is perfectly adequate for, for most couples and will give you roughly a conception lubricant for two cycles. In the centre we have uh, the most recent onto the market which is trying to conceive uh, lubricant from Astroglide. Astroglide is one of the big lubricant manufacturers in the North America and the US. In this pack you get again eight pre-filled applicators but you get five mil uh, of lubricant in each of those applicators as opposed to uh, four grams in the uh, Conceive Plus applicator. So slightly different on the uh, contents there. And if we move now to the pre-seed, this gives uh, users the uh, ability to pre-load applicators with as much or as little lubricant as they require from a 40 gram tube. Now, there is a question mark over this because uh, once the tube has been opened, uh, there isn't any guidance in terms of how soon the lubricant has to be used. The only guidance we've managed to get is an indicator of three months as a guide once the, the seal's been opened on the tube. The other thing is that the applicators, and it does recommend this in the uh, packs, shouldn't be reused, so they should be again viewed as single-use applicators, but there's certainly adequate uh, lubricant in the 40 gram tube to give you all nine uses. So again, that pack potentially could be eked out to three cycles. But again, we have to uh, emphasize that the applicators, once used intravaginally, should not be washed and reused. They are single use only. So let's just run through what these offer you. Nine applicators, eight applicators, eight applicators. Four grams, five mils, and a varying amount. So in terms of flexibility, the pre-seed pack obviously has the edge in terms of how often and how much you use. In terms of costs, Again, the marketplace is varying depending on supply and demand for these. Conceive Plus, you're looking at around £14, £14.50 for a pack. Trying to conceive, new onto the marketplace, so it's being discounted to uh, build market share at the moment. About £12 for a pack. And the Baby Start, again, varies between £15 and £18 on, depending on which marketplace you're looking at. You will find offers in the marketplace of some of these packs bundled with uh, either ultra pregnancy tests or uh, ovulation test strips. We think the most useful bundle is probably ovulation test strip because if you are using those in conjunction with these, you're getting a great indicator of the timing for using of these fertility lubricants. There's no reason to use these throughout the cycle continuously for all sexual intercourse you really should be just using these at the fertile periods in the cycle because of the expense of this compared to a normal water-based lubricant. The advantage of all of these is obviously that they are sperm friendly, fertility friendly or fertility lubricant depending on which phrase you wish to uh, focus on but all of them claim to be able to have sperm pass through them without causing a barrier effect and to have no degradation effect or damaging effect on sperm or sperm DNA so neither of these choices should put a barrier in the way of you actually conceiving none of them actually increase your fertility either what you are doing by choosing one of these products is reducing a potential uh, problem by using a traditional water-based 
or silicon-based lubricant, which can either damage sperm or cause a barrier to its passage and reduce fertility. None of these will do so. So all three products are available in the UK marketplace. Is one better than the other? We don't know. We can't say. Statistically, they've all been tested. Statistically, they all work. The one that's got the most feedback, obviously, is the one that's been in the marketplace longer, and that is the, the Proceed lubricant. So there you have the three choices in terms of brand. There are others constantly coming on and off of the marketplace, but these are the three biggest sellers in the UK currently, and they're all available from Access Diagnostics on our fertility websites.